Yo, what's good, YouTube? This is Rob Dollar back with another vid. Now, before I get into this vid, make sure you guys hit that thumbs up. Say your dollars. We love what you're doing. Make sure if you guys are new to the channel that you hit that subscription button. The subscribe button is right here on your phone. You should see it to like the lower left, of the, uh, the lower right of the video. Just hit that subscribe button and make sure you guys subscribe to my channel. One of the hottest channels on YouTube. But anyway, let me stop motherfucking making my head big with some bullshit and uh this video is basically going over the giveaway i had and people asking me yo what happened with the giveaway what happened with the giveaway you feel me and i ain't one of them scam niggas that that do giveaways and don't let niggas win like niggas really win my giveaways and usually i do giveaways from october all the way through january those are holiday giveaways but this year i wasn't doing it because i was you know, I was getting back in the swing of things early in October, November. I was still not motivated. December, I came hard. November, December, I started to come harder. So, you know what I'm saying? I was like, I didn't really do it this year. And I apologize. So, I'm setting up for another giveaway. I'm just getting the how I'm going to do the next giveaway. Because this giveaway was pretty difficult. And the reason being is because I wanted real people that take my channel serious to really... You know what I'm saying? To to see how serious you guys took it. You know what I'm saying? Cause some people they see you doing a giveaway and then you know they they that's the only time they go to your channel. You feel me? And then after that, you'll never hear from them again. Some niggas make fake accounts just to try to give them more chances to win giveaway. Like I I know how the game go, you dig what I'm saying? So some of the perks to some of the things you had to do. I said perks, I don't know why. But some of the things you had to do in my giveaway was subscribe to Sneakatopia. Which he's already over 10,000. I don't know how many subs Rishi Rich got, but. And then also give the video a thousand likes, which, as you guys can see, is only 249 likes. So automatically, that takes away from the giveaway. The giveaway doesn't have to. It just basically. It's basically the giveaway's over. We didn't hit a thousand uh, 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 likes, and so fuck it. You feel me? But also, the Twitter, Instagram, none of that shit was successful. I wanted 10,000 followers on Twitter, Instagram, and none of that shit was successful. And I ain't mad about that due to the fact that a lot of my, like a lot of subscribers that are like really, you know, like they really did, like they really see my videos and watch them and show love. A lot of them said they don't have Twitter, Instagram, and that, that shit fucked me out like, damn. And then on top of that, they fucking, the day I was supposed to announce the winner, they moved the 72 and 10s up to the 12. So it was just all fucked up. That giveaway was fucked up. So I'm I'm planning on doing a giveaway on the cement fours, but I haven't I haven't ironed out the you know what I'm saying the stuff you have to do. It won't be this ridiculous shit. You know what I'm saying a thousand likes. It won't be none of that because like I said, a lot of loyal subscribers they they was like I don't even got Twitter. I don't got Instagram. That shit fucked me. I like damn. You know what I'm saying because it's really for. I wanted to really see who was loyal to my channel, who really shows that love. You know what I'm saying? And it was just fucked up. I was just... And and then at the same time, I was still in the middle of... Look, it's October 7th when I did this giveaway. So I'm still like angry and bitter and, and just, you know... I'm, I'm not motivated, so I'm like, fuck that. If y'all want to do this, y'all got to... You know what I'm saying? I was being mad stupid with it, so... But the next giveaway won't be as difficult. I, I pro, I'm thinking about doing... um. I've been talking to some smaller YouTube channels to do a collab giveaway to help them get subs and you know what I'm saying and 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 I'm just trying to iron out the stuff you have to do like I might just do it like fucking if, if any of these smaller YouTube channels want to do a collab giveaway you ain't got to worry about nothing I'll cover the shoes whatever the shipping whatever but uh yeah I just want to help a lot of the new YouTube channels get out there like uh, there's a lot of dope channels that people don't even know about we got people that 100 subscribe 100,000 subscribers that in my opinion look I might even sound like a hater but you know what I don't give a fuck I'm just the real realist not the realist I'm just a realist like I like to keep it real a lot of a couple of channels that I see that I had a hundred subscribe a hundred thousand subscribers ain't even worth it. You feel me? And there's plenty of channels that are hotter than some of ours, even mine included, that ain't even known. You dig what I'm saying? Perfect example. Fucking Sneaker Paradise. That young nigga got a crazy channel. You dig what I'm saying? Uh, my nigga Jay. Like a lot of people got even some of the young niggas like my son age. I like uh, what's what's his name? Hold on, let me let me get his name, man. Hold on, hold on. Dope channel, man. The young, like, the, this is a young man's game. Like, that shit is, that shit is true. As far as being a young man's game, that's, it definitely is a young man's game. 
Oh, Air Max Sneakers. He got a dope channel. Young dude coming up. You know what I'm saying? Young, doing his thing. He's still learning. But I like those channels. You feel what I'm saying? Like I said, it ain't about quality. It ain't about the best graphics and all of that. It's about what you say. It's how you do it. It's just, I can feel the grind in certain people. You feel me? By watching their videos, I can tell us. It's it's an it's an official grind. It ain't none of this fugazi shit and niggas doing it trying to get to a certain space so they could get free shit or get their music heard or you know a bunch of bullshit. This is like genuine people that are really grinding. So I want to do a giveaway to help those channels out. Like I'm not really concerned about mine because my channel is gonna get to where it's gonna get to, and that's just by hard work. You know what I'm saying? I don't ask nobody for nothing. I, I try to. I ain't gonna get into all of that, but. Just hard work to get me to where I need to be or where I'm gonna be at the end when this is all said and done. But uh, yeah, so I know it's I know I'm gonna I already got an idea of where I want to go as far as the giveaway. I know if you if you follow me on Twitter, Instagram, it'll give you more entries into the giveaway. I'm gonna do it like that. You don't I don't have to hit ten thousand followers, ten thousand followers on Twitter, uh, ten thousand subscribers. I'm not gonna do it like that because I like to give back to the people that support me. And I love the people that support me. This is not a gimmick. Like, I really come out of pocket. I do this shit to entertain and just to have fun. I give you guys 100% of what it really is. You dig what I'm saying? So that's the reason why I'm doing this. I was going to do some reviews today, but it's it's pouring outside. And I wanted, I really want to give you guys the PSNYs outside so you guys can see these shits. You know what I'm saying? They not as bad as I thought when, you know, like, after the video, I looked at them, like, all right, they ain't that bad, but they not as hot as I thought they was when I seen pictures, you dig what I'm saying, so, I just, that's all I just wanted to get that off my chest, I will be having a giveaway soon, I'm hoping the Cement 4s, if I get everything ironed out before they release, and we still in December, they release in February, so hopefully we could get that popping off the ground, and, uh, just stay tuned, I got more giveaways, I mean, more reviews coming in the, in the future. If we come up with another giveaway, then, you know, we'll do that too. But uh, tell me how you guys feel about that. Like I said, the stuff that was supposed to be done on the first giveaway wasn't done. So automatically, it just put the giveaway out of commission. And then it, the, even if everything was done, I, I would have been scrambling because then I would have probably... I think they announced that the Jordans was being pushed up like on a Wednesday or something. In the middle of the week when Saturday was I was supposed to announce the giveaway winner. So it was it would have been all fucked up. I would have had to pick another shoe and it would have been it would just been fucked up. But uh yeah man, just let me know how you feel about that. Also, watch out for the scammers, man. It's the holidays. This is when the scammers come out. If you're not getting invoice, if this guy don't look legit, make sure you get uh tagged photos and everything. Like make sure you guys watch out. Watch out for those fake emails that a nigga might send you. You know what I'm saying? As far as trying to buy shoes, trying to buy anything in general, because I know a lot of people are Christmas shopping and just be real careful of the decisions you make because the scammers are at full force right now during the holidays. That's usually when they come out. So you guys got to be real careful on what you guys do. OK, so make sure you guys stay tuned. I will be putting up the reviews to the PSM. I want to do that shit outside. Y'all got to see the colors of these shoes. I mean, perfect. You know what I'm saying? You gotta. Feel, I want you guys to feel the colors like I feel them in person. I want you guys to have that experience like you got them shits in person. So you don't have to. I don't want people to regret like, damn, man, I wish I would have got those. I just want you guys to see them in person and then you decide if, you know, spending $300 was a waste of money or, damn, those shits are hot. I should have got them. You know what I'm saying? But uh, this is Rob Dollar, man. Like, comment, and subscribe. Make sure you guys share my videos. Temp, let's talk about anything. Comment down below, man. It's the holidays, and I will be bringing you guys the PSNYs and uh, the uh, 72 and 10s. I'm going to give you guys my reaction. Not 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 a review, but my reaction. Talk about the materials and what I like and what I dislike. I still feel as if the Jordan 11, 72 and 10s are the hottest retros that dropped this year. If you disagree, comment down below and tell me why. Tell me what you guys think is the hottest retro to release this year. All right, y'all? This is Rob Dollar, and guess what? I'm getting the fuck out of here. Y'all, I got to take my son to be more practice.